so I've been blessed to um, test drive this beauty over here. This is the uh, Model 3 Performance in this stunning red color. I really like this red color. You get these huge uh, P0 tires over here. You want to get this with the Performance and those calipers as well. So as you can see on the outside, it's a very gorgeous car. Very beautiful, very beautiful. Um, I think it has a really nice overall look. I, I can see what people are saying now. It kind of has that catfish looking look on it. But other than that, it's a very beautiful car. It's got a nice silhouette. You can just tell this car was just uh, made to slice through the air. But overall, very beautiful vehicle. Um, when you want to get into the Tesla, just pull these door, pull these handles, and there's the cockpit for you. As you can see, nice and beautiful in here. It's got the black uh, interior. You can get the white interior. For me, who has kids, the black interior is fine for me because uh, who wants dirty white seats? So as you can see. Uh, nice overall looking uh, appearance the back seats as you can see uh, there's enough room to get in there if you're 5'3 like me I don't know about those 6 foot people I'm not sure let's open up the trunk shall we so there's a lot of space in here you also get this uh this space over here you can probably put your groceries over here so your groceries won't be slushing back and forth all over the place um let's close her down shall we it closes by itself as you can see it took a while but it closes by itself there's a front i'm gonna try to open that i'm not sure how to open that let's see if i can do it i'm a first time tesla test driver let's see what happens Let's check it out. I believe you can. Oh, there you go. I figured it out. Hard to believe it. So open up the. Let's see that massive, beautiful 10 cylinder engine. Oh, there's no 10 cylinder engine. Nope. You got you get this frunk over here. You have enough space for a little bit more groceries. Pretty nice in here. The only fluids you gotta change is that washer fluid that's about it pretty nice how about we go inside and then we do that beautiful test drive there you go check it out very beautiful car i love this red color Whew. i'm gonna talk to my wife now let's go inside shall we so the interior of the tesla model 3 performance i got the interior with the black uh, leather uh, so currently me and my wife are looking to replace our Tundra and um, I came across this beauty I asked for a rear wheel drive because I'm about to have a baby so I'm not looking to spend millions of dollars <laughs> so um, but they gave me a performance to test drive and uh, it's really my first time uh, inside one of these beautiful cars uh, as you saw on the outside it's this red color I really love this red color with those uh, performance uh, wheels on them very beautiful and uh, right here this is one of the one of the key things that you look at when you see a Tesla in the interior is this big old screen this screen tells you everything about the car this screen you can control the lights headlights dome lights uh locking locking features as you can hear I'm a, i don't know much about teslas but this is my first time inside one a performance one model three uh display button you can control the display so basically this is like a big uh big uh ipad uh except uh it does car duties the driving you can do chill comfort standard sport i'm gonna put it in sport for you guys so that we can um see what this thing can do and um 
Well, Tesla gave me this one with 16%, so I'm gonna take advantage as much as I can. It's got autopilot, it's got a navigation, obviously, safety and security, speed limit mode. Ha! <laughs> let's, see how, let's see how far I can go. Oh, there you go, speed limit mode. That's it. But it's turned off. Service mode. Uh, I believe this is the where you see if your Model 3 is updated or not. But yeah, so this car has a lot of features. I personally, this is my first time, like I said, inside one of these. And um, um, I'm really amazed. It's really quiet compared to my Civic and my Tundra. And uh, there's a, there's a, I really like the interior. If, if you don't have any kids, I recommend the white interior. But I have kids and a newborn coming, so that black interior is good for me. And um, I'm wearing my work clothes, so I don't want to, you know, put work clothes stains on the on the car but yeah as you can see a uh, really nice interior let's see the back seats so as you can see back here well I'm five foot five foot three so I'm really short and that's my seating position for a five foot three person so as you can see I'm, I'm pretty comfortable uh you got this uh sloping roof over here uh the uh the moon roof sunroof what is it called the uh whatever the thing is called i think that's pretty cool uh, it's not as hot as i thought it would be but uh, i've heard uh that it can burn your hands off you if you put your hands on them but as you can see it's pretty nice in here you got a few comedies uh, i got a few um cup holders over here you got some uh, charges over here. I believe these are C, C type chargers. Uh, some map pockets over here. So not much back here. This is, like I said, this is just a Model 3. I have not personally sat into the Model S or the Model uh, X. I've sat in the Y, it's pretty comfortable too. So let's go on a driving scene. So before we get started, make this is the, uh, the stock over here to pull up is for reverse, to pull down is for drive, to push this button over here is to park. And uh, let's, do, let's do a reverse. So, I'm still getting used to this, uh, uh, not having to press the brake as much as often as, yours, as I normally do. So it's got some nice cameras over here where you can back up as you can see nice backup features and then once press the brake put it in drive I believe I put it in the uh, performance mode let's see what it can do there you go sport mode excuse me as you can as you hear I'm not much of a Tesla tech technical person but it's okay so here we go once again um, I'm still not used to not having to press the brake as you can see I'm not pressing the brake I'm just press. I'm just letting go of the gas. Uh, let's go. Let's see what this thing can do. As you can see, wow, very quiet in here. I don't have to press the brake. That's amazing. Uh, I forgot what that feature is called, but it yes, you don't have to press the brake. According to the the rep at Tesla, uh, brakes can last up to 150,000 miles. Because people uh, don't use the brakes much and I'm still getting used to it and I, I just got my hands on one right here so once it turns green I'm gonna stomp on it but um, I really like the view the, that I have out here from the windshield what I don't like is that this rearview mirror is, is I, uh, I can hardly see the person behind me uh, it's like a big bookshelf uh, big old bookshelf right there and uh, that's the only thing I'm not liking right now, but um, other than that, uh, nice and quiet. I'm about to stomp on it as soon as it turns green. If it, there you go, ready? <laughs> Woo! That is not tiring at all. <laughs> Very beautiful. So as you guys can see, just stomp on it and it goes. I, I'm still getting used to that. 
<laughs> it's a very over overwhelming feeling. I do like this feature right here where it can it can detect the cars right next to you. So I got two cars next to me. It doesn't de detect that Ranger over there, but uh, let's stop on it again. <laughs> Dude, that's insane. <laughs> that's really insane. There's, there's, ah, uh, I'm kind of speechless right now. Stomping, stomping on it like that. <laughs> it doesn't get old. Uh, that's some new stuff for me. That's some new stuff for me. I said, <laughs> I'm very speechless right now. So don't pay attention to the words that I'm saying. It's just, uh, I've never had this uh, exhilarating feeling. But I really like it. This. How about we do some normal driving? <laughs> some chill and comfort let's do some chill and comfort so it's very quiet 17 miles an hour it's really quiet I can hear everybody else next to me I can hear that guy's bazooka on the Civic you can hear the tires a bit and I don't know if you heard from when I was stomping it but you can hear the um, you can really hear the 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 motor the electric motors working I think that's really a uh, uh, this is my first experience driving one of these so honestly uh, I see why a lot of people um, have gone from a petrol head to electric head or whatever it's called nowadays but it's it's very beautiful I really I really I'm really surprised at what this car has been capable of doing so far and um, I'm gonna try to do the autopilot how about we do that autopilot see I don't know if I got it started forgive me if I haven't gotten it started I really don't know how to get this thing going that should be working right now so as you can see uh, I was not able to get it to work oh well uh, we'll see what happens <laughs> So overall, I think this car uh, has really caught my attention. Um, I'm going to definitely talk to my wife. Hopefully she agrees on getting a performance. I really doubt it. <laughs> Knowing my wife, I really doubt it. <laughs> but it, it, it's really calm. It's really, no, you know, uh, it's, it's just really quiet. Because I can hear that Porsche right behind me that's uh, stomping on the gas right behind me. I can hear the wheels you can hear the wheels a bit and uh, when you press the gas you can really hear those electric motors working I think that's really insane uh, especially how th this car starts at a uh, about 40,000 but that's with the rear wheel drive but if you're looking for performance I think you should really step up to um, a performance model 3 and uh, well I hope you enjoyed this uh, small review I'm not the like I said, I apologize for not being a Tesla tech with those technical um, information you probably wanted to hear, but uh, this is my first time inside one, and uh, well, hope this encourages you to buy one. All right, take care. Peace. God bless.